Starting with exercise 4.4, question number 1, sub question 2. It's given that, given the geometric representation y is equal to 3 of an equation in two variables. Two variables, what love? Two axes. X axis, y axis. Two variables, what Two axis. Chalo, dhyan dhyan. मैं पहले लिखने से पहले y is equal to 3 मुझे दिया हुआ है और ये मैं आपको समझाने से पहले मैं आप linear equation in two variables का standard form लिखना चाहूँगा क्या है? It's ax plus by plus c is equal to 0 ठीक है? जो कि मुझे यहाँ दिया हुआ है y is equal to 3 तो ये जब y is equal to 3 है तो ये 3 यहाँ प्लस में बॉर्डर क्रॉस कर गया माइनस तो मुझे क्या मिल गया माइनस थ्री ठीक है इज इक्वल्स टू जीरो अब मुझे एक्स का कुछ नहीं दिया हुआ है कुछ नहीं दिया तो कुछ रखना भी नहीं है दिस विल बी वन इंटू वाई दिस कुछ है ही नहीं ना इसका प्लेस ही नहीं जीरो इंटू एक्स इज नथिंग बट जीरो तो मुझे क्या मिलेगा जीरो एक्स प्लस वाई माइनस थ्री इज इक्वल्स टू जीरो और आई विल गेट जीरो एक्स प्लस वाई इज इक्वल्स टू थ्री so this is my equation, okay? In two variables, that is x and y. So on solving y is equal to 3, let me represent you. y is equal to 3. We will get 0x plus y is equal to 3. Now what we will do? We will take this 0x other side. We will get y is equal to 3 minus 0x. Now on solving this. We will get from equation number 1, we get y is equal to 3 minus 0x. Now, let's go with the beats. It's x, y, x, comma, y. Karna kya hai? Graph bana na hai? Okay, let me... Kyu geometric representation hai? Geometric representation in one variable matlab number line. In two variable matlab x axis, y axis. Okay, let's start. It's y is equal to 3 minus 0x. Let's assume the value of x as so, मुझे y क्या मिलेगा? 3 into 0 into 0, that is y is equal to 3. So, I will get y is equal to 3. Okay? Now, let's assume the value of x as 2. So, यहाँ क्या है? I will get 2 डालते हैं. 2 into 0 is nothing but 0. Again, I will get 3. So, मुझे क्या मिला? When I am assuming the value of x as 2, I am getting the value of y as 3. Let's see minus 2. Minus 2 डाल के देखते हैं, चलो क्या मिलता है? कुछ नहीं, zero ही आएगा, तो क्या आएगा? When I am assuming the value of x as minus 2, I am getting the value of y as 3. So my coordinates are 0 comma 3, 2 comma 3, and minus 2 comma 3. Let me write the coordinates over here. It's 0 comma 3, it's 2 comma 3, and it's minus 2 comma 3. So let us represent these coordinates on the graph paper. Let me introduce the graph paper. Now, before plotting this coordinates on the graph paper, we need to remember some points by solving the graph. We know the axis, it's x-axis, x dash, y-axis, y dash. Question number is very, very, very important. It's question number one, sub question two. Now, let's decide the scale. Look, one box is equal to one centimeter. And scale gets given to two zeros. One, two, three, four, zero. Okay. So one get equal to one. It's one on the right side of the x-axis. That is right side. One on the right side. One, two, three, positive one get equal. And negative one equal on the left side of the x-axis. Above it is positive and below it is negative. So let's plot the points on the x-axis and y-axis. Okay. Now let's plot the coordinates on the graph. It's zero on the x-axis and three on the y-axis. Some over here. It's 2 on the x-axis and 3 on the y-axis somewhere over here. It's minus 2, that is minus 2, on the x-axis and 3 on the y-axis somewhere over here. Let's draw a straight line. Okay. This y is equal to 3. This parallel to x-axis, you can see, right? So y is equal to 3. This is the graphical representation of y is equal to 3 in two variables. Why two variables? Because we have x-axis, we have y-axis. If you like it, do share, subscribe. Thank you.